Here in Waterloo Place is a rather interesting little spot. Just over here at the bottom of this tree, next to number nine Carlton House Terrace, which used to be the German Embassy, is a little really cute gravestone. It's the dog. He's called Giro. He belonged to the German ambassador. I see. Back in 1934, when the German Embassy was next door, he had this little dog, and it unfortunately chewed through some electric cables in the garden and was electrocuted. So he's buried here. So that's a Nazi dog. <laughs> you don't have to say it. Say it's such a way. That's a Nazi, that's a Nazi dog. dog. Dog's fault. It's actually a bit unfair that it's known as the Nazi Dog Memorial because the ambassador Leopold von Hirsch wasn't really a Nazi. I mean, he was already the German ambassador when the Nazis came to power and he actually strongly objected to their activities. In fact, he was so outspoken against the Nazis that they couldn't wait to get rid of him. Leopold von Hirsch was actually very popular amongst the British and when he died, one of the oddest sights was his funeral in which his coffin was draped in a swastika flag and taken down these very steps past Buckingham Palace on a gun carriage with a proper military escort all the way to Dover and then taken over to Dresden where none of the Nazi party attended his funeral, which is rather sad. But inside, um, Albert Speer, Hitler's architect, was responsible for quite a lot of the design of the inside and Mussolini donated some marble. Actually, they tried to get rid of most of the swastikas, but they, I, think, I believe there is still a border of swastikas around one of the floors inside there. Ein treuer Begleiter. I don't know what it means. I think it means a trusty companion or something like that. I'm not sure how much that guy appreciated that, actually. It's not really a Nazi dog, though, is it? Yeah, no saying what you know, what he, uh, <laughs> what ideals he. Uh, but strictly speaking, it was erected by somebody who employed mine and I was buying at the time. Is that okay?